Welcome back to Don't Diecast, Diecast Family. Walmart, we're out here in Cannon, no. I don't know where we are. These snaps, it's, it's too many Walmarts. I don't know where we are anymore. Well, in any case, let's see what this one's got inside. We're in Geneva. All right, family, we made it into the pegs. They are not super full, so that's not a great sign. We'll still give it a quick look through and see if we can find out what case this is. D case, I believe. Yep. So D case would be our Mercedes. It's always good to take a look. You know, you never know. You know, you never know. All right. <laughs> the Pagani back there. There is the awesome uh, little mod rod. The Piranha car. The money clip. What else do we got back there? Some more race cars. That is it, you guys. Nothing too crazy there. These 143rd pullback racers, you guys. Check out this Lancer Evo. This thing is really nice looking for like six, seven bucks, you know, versus the uh, 124ths that are coming out, or the one, oh my goodness, 143rd scales that are coming out. These still have rubber tires and everything. They're, they're pretty cool looking. I might pick one up to uh, do a custom on, try tearing it apart and seeing what's on the insides. All right, Matchbox, the Karma, but nothing looks like it's missing that cool square down there. Let's get over to the regular Hot Wheels. Premiums, you guys, not looking too great over here. We got a couple of Fast and the Furious, the old wave left over. Some Beatles cars, one modern classic. Oh, there is the awesome little, uh, is it a Fiat? Yeah, the Fiat Aberth. That's a really cool looking car. I like the, the two-story lorry that thing's on. It's pretty neat. Let's take a look at some of these Just Trucks because it looks like they are stacked in here. I'm not seeing anything with those cool red tires. There's plenty with red rims, but that's not what we're looking for. We want them tires to be completely red. Eventually, I'll find one that I can show you guys. What do we got here? Mom and Grad. If you guys saw the shorts that I was doing, I did a short on all three of those. The mom, dad, and grad. I'll hang this guy back up there. M2s. Let's take a look. It's down in there. That uh, that uh, Bronco. I don't know what I wanted to call it. Like a Jeep, but it's not a Jeep. The Cadillac, Corn Nuts, Datsun, Volkswagen. What's under there? The van. And then what do we got? Corn nuts, Cadillac, and another truck. Corn nuts, awesome tow truck, and another truck. Those are back together. Let's uh, jump down here and take a look. Purple Hornies, Planter Peanuts, the Foose, Scat Packers, Mopar Planters, and another Mopar and Planters. Good stack, but nothing we're looking for. We got the Quaker State and the Foose Mustang, along with the Datsun 510 down there. That is such a good looking car. Last but not least is the bin. And you know this is never a good sign when you're finding toys in here. Completely gone hangers. This just, uh, this to me is like not worth going through. Unfortunately, you guys. Yeah, all bent. All bent. All different cases. Nothing new. All right. As I turned around, I saw one more spot. We'll have to take a look back through here. What case is this? This is D case, so the Mercedes again. I bought one of these earlier, you guys. We're going to do a quick little short on this because this is really cool. This is the Autistic Self Advocacy Network. And this is a fidget spinner you hold that little silver inside you can spin the whole car around you grab onto the wheels you can spin it around any which way you like and just to to get some stress off real quick you know if you're if you're in a stressful a stressful situation and you're having some trouble getting through it grab one of those flick it around a little bit you'll notice it just falls off all right well you guys not much here we're getting to another walmart i will see you guys there all right, don't die cast family. We are at another Walmart. 
Let's see what this one has inside. Hopefully they got some cool stuff. We gotta see something. I mean, it's been nothing. It's been dry for a while. So hopefully they got some cool stuff. All right, we just got to the aisle and I am like, holy cow, how many cases of these M2s did they get here? Now, mind you, it looks like they've been all gone through, but we'll still take a look and see because this guy down at the bottom is the chase. He's super cool. And yeah, we'll have to go looking because it looks like they've all been gone through. But we'll see how many are gone. We'll see uh, if anybody got anything cool, you know? Maybe we'll put some packs together and make them all the same car so when we come back we know which ones we've been through. All right, there's, or what are those, uh, Camaros? Chevy? Yeah, Chevy Camaro. Mustangs. All right, here we go. There is the Regal Turbo. Another Regal Turbo back there. Then what else? Pan Am, Pan Am. All right, let me start putting those back together. <laughs> okay, got that cleaned up. Let's keep going through here and see what we got. Chrysler, Corn Nuts. There's another Camaro, Datsun. And Chrysler 300C. Farther back, we got these big old trucks. The C, what is it, a C600, 500? C600. It was kind of hard to read. Bunch of Datsuns. Another Pan Am. What else do we got here? Datsuns, Pan Am. Datsun, Corn Nuts, and Corn Nuts. All right. Well, there's a good amount of those gone. These Buick Regals. There's only three left out of all those cases. So hopefully somebody got something. That's really, really awesome. All right. Those are all back and cleaned up. We got the Nissan Skyline GTR R33. With like some cool drippy paint on it. That thing is pretty awesome looking. I haven't seen that one before. Up top here we got some plastic carded. Just uh, everything's a little mixed up around here. We'll have to move some stuff around while we're at it. So here we go. Auto World. M2s. Paper carded. I don't see anything good. We got a bunch of shells and planters, peanuts. Our plastic carded down here. Still love the Datsun. We got them green lights, a lift, a couple of just trucks back here. Um, yeah, some pink slips. I haven't seen anything new for pink slips in a while. And then we got some off-roads in there mixed in with the auto straws and some of the pop culture set all up and through here with a bunch of different cars. Fast and the Furious. There's an Alpha. Or no, that's an Angula. Excuse me. Oh, there's the cool ad vans from the, uh, the Boulevard set. I like those vans. Those are pretty cool. And another Angula back there. We got a couple of uh, garage sets. We got the Jay Leno garage off road. Oh, that looks like it. I thought there might have been something else because there's even more up here. Um, but let's get down here. I see M2s, but I see Fast and the Furious also. And I'm like, what is what? Let's uh, stack some of these up. Look at that guy, the Eclipse. So cool. That is a great looking car right there. Wow. Oh, back to the M2s. Okay. Let's uh, check out that Foos, Flower Power, and some Ding Dongs. And then we got our M2 haulers down here. Let's go this way so we can slide them over. Planners Peanuts. Planners Peanuts. What else do we got? Maui and Sons and Foos, Bazooka, and a Corvette. And then some Hollies and another um, Foose way back there. We put all those back. That looks like it for here. Just a couple of these uh, little alphas down here. Monster trucks. Get some good old monster jams. And regular monster trucks. Now, my buddy John ended up finding the, uh, the Nismo uh, Skyline monster truck. That is super cool. I have not seen that one myself yet. But let's get over to some of these Matchbox. Surf through these. See if we see any missing squares through there. 
And then look at all the Japanese imports they got here. Awesome, awesome set. There's only one starlet in each one of those packs, I believe. So it is a hard one to get out of there. And then we got the uh, the Hot Wagons and some Gran Turismo. What we got back there? A bunch of Volvos and the Audis. Um, Hot Wheels, yeah, not looking too great. Let's uh, let's see if they have a dump bin and see if that's any better. We'll have to walk in and see. And here is the dump bin. So, I don't know. It's not like the worst looking set, but it's not the best. So, I'm going to put you guys down for a second and clear through just a little bit of this and see what I can find out. All right, family. I got down to where everything was stacked up and stacked up a bunch myself. There was nothing there. But you always got to have hope for the next one. Let's get to the next one. I will see you guys at another Walmart. All right, family, we made it to our last Walmart. Let's see what this one has. Hopefully they got some new stuff. This has been terrible all this week, you guys. We haven't been finding anything. Kind of bumming me out, but I'm keeping my fingers crossed. Let's see what we can find in here. All right, family, we made it in. Let's take a look and see what they got here. Um, you know, these restocks just did not help anything out, I feel. Let's take a look at these paper card of M2s. We got the Shell, the Planters Peanut, some uh, Performance, Chevy Performance, El Turistas, and another Shell back there. Look at this guy, the, uh, was a Strawberry? Strawberry Fanta. We got one of the Moms, and we got a Grad back there. Um, some Fantas. Some lifts, some Mopar lifts. I think that's a Volkswagen, yep. And another Volkswagen. Mopar, 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 Mopar. Tons of Mopar. All right, NASCAR Authentics. This is 2024 Wave 1. And that is number 5 right there. Super cool looking car. I imagine that blue would be awfully chromey if he... Uh, was the chase out of there but he is number five we'll take a look and see if there's any more 14 8 no nothing all right we'll have to hang those back up kings of crunch you guys holy cow there is just a ton we'll try to go through this the best we can without knocking everything off the pegs let me push these back make things a lot easier Silver tires, what is that? The USA 1. Um, I don't even know what you are. AM, PM. Let's see, the Bigfoot. AM, PM. I think that's Crimson Crusher. AM, PM. That is the Scottsdale, but those blue tires are not what we're looking for. And then some pink tires in the back. Um, I see some up top, but... Wow, they're stacked up up there. I don't know if we'll ever be able to check all those out. Um, green light. We got the Chevy Caprice, the T1 uh, thing, and the Cadillac Eldorado. That Cadillac's really cool looking. Let's stick back over here and look at some of these M2s. Mr. Pib, Tab, another Tab. We got some Foos, some Ford Motor Company. Looks like some Mopar behind there. And a Quaker State. We have that in the raw. That is my one and only raw. But super cool. Alright, some of these M2s. Let's see what we got in here. Oh my goodness, there is stuff out of its whole packaging. Let's take a look and see what's back there. That Datsun's got a busted case. There's another Datsun. What are you? The Cutlass 442. That's a cool one. Got the van down there. Oh, geez, that Datsun just torn to bits. And that looks like it, you guys. All right, let me put some of those back, and we'll scoot over. Way better. All right. We got some more lifts over here, too. Thundercats, some boulevards. There's the new Yanko Stinger, and some of the old Anguilas. Let's take a look at our Starship Selects. Let's see if we see any blue on any... So you see blue on these little stripes here, too, right across where the name tag is. But I don't see anything. There's one more up there. He is not either. 
So let's keep on cruising across some off-road, all Impalas, and oh wait one second. Oh, and an Alpha, you know, for who knows. Hopefully they discounted that because I don't know who's going to buy that. But, you know, monster trucks, I always tell you guys that look at them. We'll go through them together real quick. This is a cool one. The Bomb Shaker. Hmm. I like that. It's got a really cool color to it. What else do we got? There is an actual Bone Shaker. Hot Wheels Pizza. The Hot Wheels Delivery. I don't even know how I'm knocking stuff off all the way down there. But it's happening. All right. Let's move on over. Okay, we got some moving parts over here. Citron, the Lexus, the Mazda RX-7, Javelin, Javelin, Volkswagen, and a Citron. And an RX-7 hiding back there. What else do we got? Some Focuses. Looks like they got quite a bit of a restock of these. And the Alpha. And then some old school ones back there from last year. Got ourselves some regular matchbox. We just need to look for that missing square on these. And I'm not seeing it. I don't know what it is. I found supers. I found all sorts of stuff. But never a matchbox chase. Um, Gran Turismo. They got some Porsches, Mustangs, a BMW. Some Porsches. A 356 Speeder. Japan, Japan imports the Honda not a bad little bunch of cars right there all right family I found some of the Hot Wheels we got some Civic EG sitting out in front the Pontiac what else do we got the Camaro um, the XC40 the fidget car a Canon another um, Oh, what you call it? A Civic. Another Civic back there. And a Mercedes. And I can't tell if this is new or old. It's it's really difficult to see. So I might tear through a little bit of this and see what we can find. Alright, I dug all the way down, down into here and stuck it all back. Unfortunately, there was nothing there. Let's see if they got some more Hot Wheels. I'm pretty sure they do. Okay, I found some more. Let's see what we're working with here. This is E-Case. That's looking a little bit better. Now, let's take a look. Hot dog car back there. Piranha. Some cars falling off the pegs. Me making it worse. That's what I usually do. No. <laughs> Night Dragon. Alpha. The Layin' Low Rider. Wheelie Chair. Alpha. Alpha. What's way back there? Another wheelie chair. Pontiac. Aztec. Wheelie Chair. Oh... Glory Chaser, Tahoe, Alpha, Land Rover, Hot Wired, Flippin, Flippin, Alpha Brickin. Gonna make a wrap out of this. Um, but it doesn't look like much of anything is left down in here, as in good cars that we wanna see. It's kind of a bummer, you guys. It's been a, a, a dry couple weeks, like I said. But I think that may be it. Well, you guys, I had a great time hunting with you. I hope you had a great time hunting with me. I will catch you all in the next one. Peace out.